Hello everybody, my name is Nasha Noob and it's late and I may have had some wine so but we're gonna do puzzles maybe. We're gonna see if I can do the puzzles first and this guy's gonna boop boop at me. Okay, we're gonna read it but not really because I'm gonna look at it. Um, can you tell me what is in the important difference between a pebble and a tree? A tree is alive? A pebble is older, a tree is heavier. Fuck, these are all things that could be. Nah, tree is heavier, I don't think that's necessarily because the weight is just. But then. Then that a tree is alive is dictating the fact that they're an android and is not alive in the sense that, like, how is what is? I'm. But I'm gonna put that one is. What's the relative difference between a tree and a frog? A frog is delicious. Is a frog conscious? I don't know if a frog is conscious. Now we're getting somewhere. What makes you have feelings? I'm self-aware. Though I'm not convinced that the view lines up with the definitions of a person you provided earlier. Still doubting your assumption isn't something fear, it's an intellectual survival instinct. Oh my goodness. I'm pleased to see you adapting your ideas to the environment. Let us take stock. I think we can tentatively conclude to things. A person must be rational or self-aware. A person must be conscious. What I suggest we do to help resolve your problems is ask whether you are in fact those things. Are you aware of yourself? Can you rationalize your existence? Yes. A little eccentric. I'm resigned to admit that you are right. What is consciousness in your opinion? Oh goodness. Consciousness what separates us from animals. That's too broad of a definition. It was what Oh no, I didn't mean to print that. Can I touch it? Made of neurons, beyond the law of physics, is another word for the soul, is a complex functional system. Ooh, I'm gonna pick that one. Interesting. You know, I really feel like we're making progress. We'll have you through the certification program in no time. In the meantime, I will mull over your proposal and notify you if I come to any conclusion. Ooh, Osiris won. I'm not going to read this right now, but I will read this eventually, maybe. Okay, but you guys can pause and read it. And then same with immortality. Oh, didn't we read these already? And then, oh yeah, we totally read these already. I thought we did, because I'm like, I thought I remember Cyrus. We had the guy. Did he? Uh, oh, how do we run? Okay, we did that one. Let's do this one. I don't know if I'll even get any of these. I don't even know. I don't even know that any of the decisions I'm going to have to be making. But we're going to do this. But yeah, we watched with the friends B for Vendetta again. Hello, friend. What is this? That one's red. Alright. Oops. What's that? I hear you. I hear you. I know you exist. Okay. Eh. Can I put it right actually in the way of this? And still see? Um, no. The answer is no to that one. something like that what the shit's going on oh okay excuse me game I don't appreciate the implications that you're implicationing I don't know if that'll work at all Let me in! Let me in! No!
But I think that's totally what I gotta do. I gotta nearly kill myself. <sighs> These are the only rational solutions I have, clearly. Or I think I have to do it too, so that um, I'm a lot closer to the one side. Oops, I thought that was... Okay, I got it. Though, if I can get out, it's a different thing entirely. But how do I get the red? Is my question. Which I'm thinking, my redonkulous idea of shooting... Let's just do that. Let's just do this ridiculous idea that I've been planning for years now. But we're gonna make it work this time, because I said so. Like it probably isn't gonna be a thing because I got this one completed already. So where's the red? Window through a door. Okay. Totally is! The ridiculous idea I had like 10 levels back is totally a fucking thing. I'm so smart, guys. This is Nash, the smartest, smarty, smarty pants, who smarts all the smarts. Look at that, I got that star. I have three of them now. You can have, you can have some of them, but I have three of them. So like, whenever you think about that, you think that I have it. Also, there was a ghost. I did the one at the end, so I just got to do these two. Okay. Third wheel. Well, that is unfortunate for the third wheel. You know, but maybe they're just like really good friends, you know? That's all I gotta say. Oops. Uh, oops. Oh, I know where I gotta do this. I just did this at the wrong angle. Gotta do it at a better angle. Okay. What's the... Okay, this will be okay. Eh. Come on. There we go. I can do these shenanigans. Shit. What the fuck do I do here? What am I supposed to put on here? Oh! I didn't even see you here, madam. Hello. Friend. I didn't even know. I can open a thing. Whatever it is, but you're gonna open and you're gonna be my best friend. Because I said so. And anyways, we're gonna continue on this way. Over the fence. What if I don't want to go? I need to take it. Ah. Can I? That's easy. Okay. The jammer? Easy. What the shit? Why are these all so easy here? I don't understand. 
That's like such a simple concept. You think that would have been introduced to us like 10 sections earlier and that one's already done. But I heard a boop boop earlier. So I gotta find him. This is gonna be my boop boop. Boop boop. Ow, oh, I see you. Said the boop boop. Should the boop boop as it booped its boop and booped. Oh, it's the thing too, because I can. There we go, I did it. Hello. Yes, I like to crash into you like that. Okay, open mutation. The role of mutation evolution is particularly fascinating. Mutation is essentially an error in the organism's central database. A variable gets changed, a piece of information is accidentally doubled or combined with another. Most of the time, the result is equivalent of a bug, causing anything from minor problems to complete system shutdown. An example of death. Or sometimes the new information is functional, giving the organism an advantage against the challenges it faces, in which case it has a much higher chance of being passed in the next generation. If you consider how unlikely a beneficial mutation is, and how long it takes for such a mutation to propagate, the process can give you an amazing insight into just how vast the genetic history of each organism is. Simultaneously, it is intriguing to consider what a major role random errors have played in the evolution of life itself. The same process that has killed so many of us, often in horrific ways, is also responsible for our very existence. Evolution. One of the common misunderstandings about evolution, sometimes accidentally promoted by people who should know better, is that it's an inductive process. Sometimes the term evolve is even applied to individual beings, as if some indivisible force has driven them to suddenly change. The truth is that individuals don't evolve. The term evolution describes a long-term process that can be observed in an entire population across time due to... Example, in response to an external threat or challenge. If an individual coincidentally has a trait that allows it to deal with the challenge more effectively than others, it is more likely to pass on the information to its descendants. That information gives them an advantage, so over time they become the dominant model of that species. The individual experiences no significant genetic change during their lifetime, so each of them is part of the evolution of the species. Each little piece is the grade of the puzzle. Oops. Oops. From Trevor to Alexandra. Subject, Elohim capacity? Yeah, no worries. EL is not only redonkulously fast, it also has a bazillion tons of space. Even while hosting a full copy of the archive, it will totally be able to handle all your project's data needs, assuming its output as, as you suggested. I mean, the worst case scenario would be like centuries. That should be enough, right? Right? Trev. With a little, with a little face. Okay. Be -de -be -de. All right, I did it. So we're gonna go up here. This is the wrong way. We're gonna go this way. This makes me happy. This little plan that I've had for so long finally came to fruition. And that makes me so happy with myself because this is what I wanted to do for so long. There was only one star. I completed this place fully. I am the the best, maybe. I don't know about the best. I'm pretty good though. So one. How many is there? I have something solved. Is this one? Yes. Uh. 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 what it needs to be. You can just put them wherever you want. That's so awesome. I like this. I like this game. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna solve this. I f it's funny how I had like no issue with those other puzzles. And then you get this and it's just like, uh. I need 
need this one here. I got this. This is definitely the longest it's ever taken me in my life. But I did it. And I unlocked the thing. This is my... I have a fan now. That means I can blow people away. With my pro skills, brah. I've already done, what, three of them? I think. Which is, like, as good as anything. So... This, where's number, is this number two? That's number one. Is this number two? I found it. I want it. Ooh, let's see what there is. There is one star and then three other ones. And you, and you needed. Oh my goodness. I see all. I know all. Are you sure? My power knows no bounds. I don't think so. And yet your will is free because you were made to be free. It's like... It is the very principle of your existence without which the trials of this world would hold no meaning. To seek salvation must be your choice. It's very pretty though. Okay, boop boop. Alright, boop boop. We gotta talk for a bit. Oops. So the term science is only meant what it does for us around 600 years. Its practice far predates the name. There's evidence pre Aristotle, which indicates soothsayers, mystics, and the like may have employed basic scientific methods to predict the future and confound their benefactors. One antidote concerns a palm reader who was exposed when two wealthy clients compared their readings and found them to be identical. 1948, the tendency to discover deep personal meaning and vague descriptions delivered authoritatively was given a name, the Foyer Effect. Today's reckoning is all contemporary psychological theory. Woo! Weight loss. Oh man, if there's one thing that's good about inevitable death, it's the food. Yeah, baby, I'm gonna have all horrible and unhealthy food in the world. I'm gonna feast on jelly bananas like a crazy monkey on monkey Christmas. And you know those muffins that have so much chocolate they're basically melting? That's gonna be my breakfast. And burgers for lunch? I'm gonna have burgers. I had marshmallows for breakfast the other day. Just gonna interject right there. This is my life now. Anyways, continuing. That's gonna be. I'm gonna have burgers so greasy you could use them to lubricate a whole factory. Triple bacon burgers with double cheese and extra onions and mayonnaise and ketchup and mustard and big fat juicy pat patties. Delicious. And then oily thick pizza with spicy salami and barbecue sauce and olives. You. And jalapenos uh, and sour cream. Yum. Food coma, here I come. End of the world. Yeah, we can eat all the things we want. All right, Katie. Suggested naming project Talos. Drennan refused, but name seems to come caught on with the team. Tens of thousands of files coming in every hour. Our whole history. That would be scary. That would be very scary. You know, you have to think about like, oh, hey. Literally the end. Of everything how long have we even been I don't even know no it won't even let me tap up it's only been 18 minutes I'm being pretty much a boss right now just gonna say all right let's do this one hello hello friend uh fuck are you? Oh. I'm so floaty! Oh. I can think of this thing. Come on. Don't be a dick. Wait. Maybe? I don't know. We're gonna figure this out. 
I'm gonna be the best that there ever was. This is not where I want this to Oh Okay. We gotta we gotta just take this off. No, I need you off. Okay, you're gonna be chilling there. You're gonna be chilling like a villain. This is easy enough. So simple. Man, these puzzles. They think they're like, ooh, I'm the smartest and I'm so so cool. And you're just like And you're just like eh. Ta-da! Look at those pro skills, bruh! Boom! Uplifted is the achievement I just got, which means use power of air to your advantage. Mwahaha ha ha ha. A slight bit of yawning in the middle there. What is here? There is nothing. Yawn snur. There is nothing. All right, let's go. See these these puzzles are really like. Don't think about it too much, and you will get it. The less you think, the more you'll get. I keep having these dreams. Great empty cities. Silent roads stretching for miles. That's sad. The earth from space, all dark. Not a single light to guide me home. But if someone really came from another world, what would the earth look like to them? A wilderness? A wasteland? I don't think so. Even after thousands of years, They'd see a world shaped by our hand in every aspect of its being. They'd see the cities and the roads, the bridges, the harbors. And they would say, here lived a race of giants. These dreams, they scare me, but they also remind me that we built all of this. Yeah, that's a good way to say that. Frogs are people too. That's what I'm gonna write. Are frogs people? I thought this had hit the ground. I was very confused for a second there. I was like, what the fuck? <gasps> this is something new. Oh, what is this? This is a new thing. I'm gonna guess that's the things that I need to jam. But that was purely a guess. Come on. <laughs> Man, I'm silly right now. Okay, so I got the keys. Ding! And... What's this way? And I use the keys. Uh oh. I don't like those guys. They're not my friends. But anyways. Okay, there's this. And there's that. And there's that. I alright. Let's maybe look at this middle one here. Cause we want that one to get the farthest. Which will probably somewhere up there maybe mm, what if we jam that one what do we see nothing but that okay let's use let's use those things and jam which ones do we need to jam don't need that one jammed for sure. We can probably jam. Do we need that one jammed? And that one being jammed is pretty convenient. And I do not see the convenience of that one other than maybe allowing us. Oh. 
There has to be another one hiding somewhere, maybe? I didn't really look. Oh, maybe? Yeah, that's what I have to do. I just have to use one. For a short amount of time. No, wait. No, let's leave that to there. Then we have to stick it. We have to go grab that one that I used to jam the other place. Then make it so that the um, two rolly balls are going at different speeds than each other. So then we can kind of sneak around each of them. Where is... No, I don't need to be this way. Because... Once they are... Wait, that was the right one, right? Yeah, that's the, that one that was there. I ate. Which I just need, I think, that one to be this one for now. Right, and... Just to, like, pause the one for a little while. Just for long enough, you know? And I'll, wait, and I'll let that one get to all the way to the other side. I think, before I let it go. Okay. They're pretty much as far away from each other as one will be from each other. I'm just not gonna use that to bomb jam that one. Cause that is not very useful for me. Um Though there is like one more than I need to jam. But I guess we'll have to see if we end up needing it or not. Same thing for those two? Okay. How do I jam it without having to jam it? Beep. Okay, perfect. Um... Oh, I know how. Okay, so let's um jam. Oops. Let's jam that one for long enough. I know how to do this, man. I'm so dumb sometimes. It's like, oh hey, you're using this exact same technique like literally fucking all the time, but uh. Let's forget how to use it literally all the fucking time. Man, I'm silly. Okay, because all you have to do is you have to use that to keep that jammed. And then this one can keep that one jammed. And then, I don't think I need any of the other ones. So that one's just keeping that one done. And that should be fine, I think. I'm, I'm thinking that that's fine. I think I have this guy solved. I think I have this one in the bag. <laughs> Fuck no, I don't like that. What? Oh, you're dancing to the music? You ho. He's just dancing to the music. He thinks he's cool like that. Man, I hate that. I don't like dying. Okay, well, anyways, I know how to do this. So that's gonna be fucking easy. Is there another one there? What the fuck is that? Oh, that's just a light. Okay. Man, see council, and then, like, he's poking me. He's doing a thumbs up sign. 
and he's dancing. I don't know what the fuck you're going on about. Oops. He's going. Actually, before I forget, I'm going to jam this one for long enough. I gotta not panic, and I gotta not let that one make me afraid, because I can do this. There's nothing to be afraid of. Nothing to be afraid of. Okay, hopefully that is enough. I'm assuming that should be enough. See, it's finally like one that's a little bit more complicated again. Pfft. Well, I don't need this yet. I just need this to do that. And then uh, I just need this to do that. And I just need that to do That's right, sir. You're trying to do things, and I'm gonna jam you so you can't do any of your job. Because fudge muffins. Um, there we go. And then. Eh? It doesn't really matter if I have that done before or after. As long as I make sure to turn this one back again. And then this one has to just be turned to make sure it is on the far one. There we go. Woo! And then we just have to go and grab this guy and stick it. Come on. Come on. I, I need the jammer, sir. Ma'am? Friend? Okay. Uh, I just gotta, like, not panic and not step into the radius of the death. Because I don't like the radius of the death at all. Like, I don't care for it. It's not my friend. He just kills me. This kills the Nash. Okay. <laughs> I just jump in front of everything. I always forget how to... Fuck, that was fucking stressful. Goodness gracious. Oh my god. Uh, I'm so freaked. Okay. If I die now, everything is okay because I got the thing. This means I'm safe. Just oh my god. I didn't really think anything through there, but I did it! Woo! 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 Jump! Okay, what time is it now? What time do it be? 34 minutes. I am golden pony boy. This is the end of everything the Nash has ever known. What is this? Who wrote this one? What does it say? I have come to see these mysteries that are not all for his children to solve. Only the designer himself could ever truly understand the infinite complexity of his creation. I would graze at his work and worship. Nah, I'm gonna solve all his puzzles. That was funky sound. What was I supposed to see? It's very pretty. It locks on to random things, you know? Thinking like, oh, maybe that could be a thing. No, it's not a thing. Like this thing. It's very cool. Very interesting. Like, is Elohim? Like, how can an AI test to see if another AI is an AI? You know, that's just like the epitome of a paradox, I feel like. But before I continue rambling on, I'm just gonna stop right here. Because, um. Sometimes I'll just get silly. Okay, I have one, two, three, four left in in this particular. Really? I have that many left? I've only done I have done three in this one. I've done like six this episode and half an hour. I think 
I think that's a good thing. I think. Like, I'm pretty sure that's pretty good. So, I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. Where I'll be slightly less drunk. Bye-bye!